day in May. Hey everybody and welcome back to Element A Day in May. Today's element is Europium. A lot of you guys have seen me talk about this book, The Disappearing Spoon, a lot. Sam Keen is the author. This is a national bestseller and one of the inspirations for Element A Day in May. And Sam has done two guest host videos for us now, one last year, one this year. And I just reread the section on the element Europium, which talks about how it's used as an anti-counterfeiting tool for paper money. So I wanted to read you a little bit of a section of this. Okay, so just a little bit of context. To prepare the ink, this is ink on paper money, EU treasury chemists lace a fluorescing dye with European ions, which latch onto one end of the dye molecules. Okay, so I'm going to skip down to this part. The fluorescing dyes are selected so that europium appears dull under visible light, and a counterfeiter might be lulled into thinking he has a perfect replica. Slide a euro note beneath a special laser though, and the laser will tickle the invisible ink. The paper itself goes black, but small randomly oriented fibers laced with europium pop out like party-colored constellations. The charcoal sketch of Europe on the bills glows green, as it might look to alien eyes from space. A pastel wreath of stars gains a corona of yellow or red, and monuments and signatures and hidden seals shine royal blue. Sam makes science so poetic and lovely. Since I've been a little bit late with posting the videos the last couple of days, I figured I would do this one as kind of a bedtime story. Uh, but stay tuned. I have so many guest hosts coming up this week for Transition Metals. We are almost finished with Element A Day in May. We just have about a week left. Thank you guys for sticking with me, and don't forget to subscribe and share with your friends. Element A Day in May.